Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Now we'll continue al wadatu salisa sakkan al dasu salisa wa rishroon al kira'a at tadribu al awwil unzur wastami wa aid. So here we have this vocabulary. If anyone wants to read, just raise a hand. Miss Fazna Said, kindly read and translate and read and tell me the meaning of meaning of these words. Baitum, house, shakatum, apartment, gurfa, uh, room, hammam, bathroom, matbah, kitchen, daur, floor, sarir, Sarir bed, sitara curtain, arika sofa, sajada rug, khurfat naum, bedroom, khurfat judus, living room. Atrib al khamis unzur wastami wakra. Miss Abdi Hassan, kindly read and translate these sentences. Miss Amin Abdi Hassan. <clears throat> I think she is not available. Someone else who wants to read, raise her hand. Miss Satya, read and translate it. I'll live in the house. Aspuno fi shakati. I live in an apartment. Fi shakati salasu gurfati. Ura fin. Fi shakati salasu gurfin. Ura fin. Fi. Fi shakati salasu gurafin. There are three rooms in the apartment. A shakatu fitauril fitauril awali. A shakatu fitauril awali. Apartment is in the first floor. Correct. Uridu Mushahadat Mushahadatare Azazi Mushahadatal Asas, okay. Uridu Mushahadatal Asasi. I want to I want to see furnitures. Correct. Uridu Mushahadatal Matba. I want to see the kitchen. Naisha Tadrib said this Unzur was the May Wakra. Look and listen and read. So, anyone who wants to read, raise an hand. Miss Rama, read and translate this paragraph. Hal yes kunu Ahmad Pishakot. Read the paragraph, not the question. Read the paragraph. Okay. Ahmad yes kunu Pishakot. Jamilatin. Jamilatin. Translate it also. Okay. Pishak. Okay. Pishakotin. Jamilatin. Ahmad is living in. Mm. In a in beautiful apartment, apartment, beautiful apartment. Ahmad lives in a beautiful apartment. Ahmad living in a beautiful apartment. A shakot fi hayi 
Matari. Matari. Tu fi hayil matari. Okay. Ashako tu fi hayil matari. The apartment fi in the airport neighborhood. The apartment is in the airport neighborhood. Okay, the apartment, the apartment in, in the airport. Neighborhood, okay. A shark cut the dowry sanis. Okay, a shark cut the dowry sanis. The apartment. Dowry. The apartment is in the floor. third floor. Okay. Okay. The apartment is in the third floor. Student. Just raise your hand who wants to raise. Okay, Miss Rabi Shehu, read and translate it. Miss Rabi Shehu, if you are okay. Read and translate it. Fish shakatin hamsu gurufati. Fish shakati hamsu gurufatin. Fish shakati hamsu gurufatin. That gurufatin. Gurafin. Gurafin. He is living. No. Fishakati in the apartment. Fishakati in the apartment. Hamsu Gurafin five At In the apartment there are five rooms. Okay. In the in the Fi Naomi Sarirun. In the bed, in the bedroom, there is bed in the bedroom. Okay. Figure fatil julus ari katun. In the city room, ari katun. There is sofa. There is. There is a sofa in the living room. There is a sofa. There is a couch. Coach. There is a coach in this living room. Fill mat the bahi for forunu. In the kitchen, there is a gas cooker. Oh, there's a one, okay. Fill hamamin mirror atun. In the bathroom, there is a mirror. Okay, if any lady has, has any question, she can ask me. No question, okay. So these questions are your homework. You will write their answers here in front of it and upload the homework to Google Classroom. You might have noticed that I am slowly, slowly removing the people who are not doing their homework. So doing homework is very necessary and very important. So you write the home answers of these questions here and upload it to Google Classroom so that I can check. Next, we have Al Wahdatu Rabia, fourth unit. Al Hayatul Yomiya, daily life. So, in this unit, we'll study about the daily life things. <coughs> Al Wahdatu Rabia, fourth unit. Al Hayatul Yomiya. I think we better start it next time. Now, we need to revise some Holy Quran lesson. So I need us to last time we studied this. I need a student who will read and translate it word by word. So raise your hand if you know the answer. Okay, Miss Satya, you will read it and tell me the word by word meaning of it. Okay. Um, 
most beneficent most beneficent rahim most merciful alhamdulillah rabbil alamin alhamdu uh, most praise all praises <coughs> Alhamdu, all praises. All praises. Uh, all praises. Uh, Li belongs to. Um, belongs to Allah. Uh, Rabbi, Rabbi, Lord. Al, Al Amin. Whole universe. Um, Ar Rahman Nir Rahim. Ar Rahman most beneficent. Beneficent. Ar Rahim most merciful. Okay, now Miss Salva, you will read and tell me the word by word meaning. Bismi name of Allah most uh, Rahim most um, merciful. Alhamdu mm -hmm. al praise Lillahi for Allah Rabbil Alameen Rabb uh, Lord Al Alameen for all world. Ar Rahmani most beneficent Ar Rahim most merciful. Maliki King Yomidin Day of the Judgment Eh Iyaka only you Nabudu we worship. Iyaka and only you, Nastain, be ask help. No, Miss Hartini. Do you hear me? Okay. Now, Miss Hartini, you will read the last line. Oh, okay. I, I'm reading already. Okay, um, read it again. There was some problem with my internet. Okay. Siratal, Siratal Alladina, and Amta Alehim, Gairil Magdubi Alehim, Waladolin. So what is the meaning of Siratal Alladina and Amta Alehim? Guide me to the straight path, not to the those who. Okay, let's miss Hartini. Listen, please. What is the meaning of Sirat? Uh, right path. Sirat means path. It only means path. Okay. Path. Path. Yeah. Al, what is meaning of Allah Zina? Allah Zina, uh, to the straight path, 
Okay, listen. Uh, were you please, uh, present when we started this uh, lesson? Yes. Okay. Did you understand that lesson? Yes, yes, I did. Okay. But you need to listen more, okay? Because there are okay. many mistakes. So, Miss Khatija, read this one. Start from this word. Ehdina. Ehdina sirat al mustaqim. Ehdina, guide us. Okay. The path, the straight. Correct. Sirat, sirat al ladina an amta alayhim. Path, um, the ones, um, your blessing, on them, on them. Okay. Rayril maqtubi alayhim, not the ones with your wrath on them. Correct. Well, let darling, and not the ones who have gone astray. Correct. So, if anyone has any questions, she can ask me now. <coughs> I think nobody has any question. So as you all know that tomorrow is uh, Thursday. Yes. Thursday and Friday, you will have a holiday, weekly holiday. And we will continue our class on Saturday. So during these two holidays, you all better complete your homework. And if you face any problem in the homework, feel free to ask me on my WhatsApp number, okay? okay. Thank you. You're welcome. So, Miss Hartini, come here. We both now practice the dialogue again. Okay, Miss Hartini, I will ask you and you will answer me. Yes, In case yes. If you find any difficulty, feel free to ask me. Okay, uh, inshallah, inshallah. Assalamu alaikum. Wa alaykum as salam wa rahmatullahi ta'ala barakatuh. Mas muki. Ana. Ana ismi hartini. Or you can just say ismi hartini. That is enough. Okay, let me ask you again. Mas muki. Ismi hartini. Good. Kaifaha luki. Alhamdulillah. Alhamdulillah. Good. Bink. Alhamdulillah. Khair. Okay. Min aina anti. Minal Philippine. Okay. You see ana minal Philippine. Let me ask again. Min aina anti. Ana minal Philippine. Okay. I am from Philippines. Min ayi madinatin anti. Ana minal Manila. Okay, Ana minal Manila. Okay. Ma jinsiyatuki. Ana jinsiyatu Filipina. You will just say Ana. Ana Filipini, yeah. Let me ask you again. Ma jinsiya tuki? Ana Filipini, yeah. Filipini, Filipini, yeah. So Miss Kinza is asking what is the meaning of balad? Balad means country. Mm, balad. Okay, now Miss Hartini, tell me about yes. your brother. What is his name and what is his profession? Hada Hada Aki is Hada Hada Haki Jamsil. Okay, as Haza Aki Shamsil. Who are who are therapist? Okay, who are therapist? You have not studied about therapist yet, so you'll just use a simple profession like Mudaris. 
هذا كمس هو مدرس اوكي هذا اوكي اوكي هذا اكي جمسيد هو مدرس اهلا وسهلا اهلا وسهلا ما سلام جسك لو كاير but i will not let you go like this because today you have made many mistakes you need to practice more yes. so inshallah inshallah next time i will ask you some more question regarding the next dialogues okay inshallah inshallah you need to be strong and everyone make mistakes at the start everyone feel difficulty in learning arabic in the beginning but later yes. inshallah it will become easy for you so now i need to more to students who will practice this dialogue miss salwa and miss satya miss salwa yes okay miss satya needs an apartment she will come to your office so welcome her to your office first Miss Salwa, what will you say to her? You will say Assalamu Alaikum. How may I help you? Assalamu Alaikum. Wa Alaikum Assalam. How may I help Ma'azat you? Ma'azat. Okay. What did she ask? Miss Satya will say, "I want an apartment, please." Ah uh, ah. Uh... Miss Satya will ask how many rooms are in the apartment. Kam gurfatin, kam gurfatin fi shakka. With the word "come," the next word should have two things. It should be singular and it should have "fatha." So you say "come gur fatan fishaka." Come gur fatan fishaka. Fishaka ti khamsa gurf. Khamsu gurfin. Khamsu gurfin. Miss Satya will say, "I want to see the apartment." Uridu mushahada shakka. Okay, uridu mushahada. Tafazzal. Hazihi shakka. Haza babu shakka. Okay, no problem. No, Miss Sati has got an apartment. So you, she needs to buy some furniture for the apartment. If anyone else wants to practice this, just raise her hand. Anyone who wants to practice the dialogue, raise her hand. I think Miss Hartini wants to practice again. Okay, Miss Fazna. So Miss Satya, you will visit the Miss Fazna shop and you will buy furniture for your apartment, okay? So Miss Fazna will ask you, how may I help you? Do I want to read first? Miss Fazna will read first. Miss Fazna, I ask her how may I help you? I say I forgot what to ask. Sorry, what? I forgot. Okay, you will say Aya Khidmatin. Aya Khidmatin. Okay, Miss Satya. Uh, or you do? Uridu Basel Asasi Min Fazlika Uridu Basel Azazi Min Fadli. So, Miss Fazna will ask, What do you want for the bedroom? Maza Maza Turidu. Correct. Gurfat uh, 